Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. My name is Finnur Blackwolf, and in today's episode, we are going to go to Jaden Hall, and then possibly the Imperial City, and then he'll leave Bruma for last. So we are on the second to last uh, quest. Um, I, now, I did record this prior, uh, but I, it's kind of a blessing in disguise because... Um, well, I'll start here. Like, basically, I got a, um, I went to one of the shrines, right? Uh, basically, it's one of the pilgrimages that you can find around, uh, uh the, um, it's basically, uh, one of the shrines, like the Shrine of Talos, Julianos, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. How Oblivion works, most of you probably know this, is that you can't just go to a temple in one of these cities and, re and and just get a blessing. You have to make a pilgrimage to the shrines that are around the map, which is easier said than done because they're not actually technically marked on the map. So, um, you know, so Talos is kind of like right around here. So I got a blessing of Talos, upgraded my strength and everything like that. So, um, because I did Jaden Hall once before and, but unfortunately I got like, debuffed to a point where my strength was not good so um yeah but like like i said it's kind of a blessing in disguise because uh my mic was muted and i'm kind of mighty glad that i didn't upload that episode um and everything like that so yeah so let's see so we are gonna go to jaden hall And I kind of know, know, know what I'm going to do after this, so. So let's see here. Let's see. So as you can see, my strength, all of my stuff is all good and well and dandy. Matter of fact. Man, that classic Oblivion music. Yes. I've come to disturb you. I don't have time to chat right now. With that Oblivion gate looming outside the city walls, we're bracing for an attack. Perhaps we can speak later. My first responsibility is to the people of Chadenhall. They look to me for protection in these dark times. With an open Oblivion Gate just outside our walls, I cannot risk weakening Chaden Hall's defenses, even for such a worthy cause. Not long ago, one of those foul gates manifested itself just outside the west gates of our city. Nothing's come out of it yet, but we fear the worst. My son, Farwell, has taken some knights and entered the gate bravely in hopes of meeting the enemy head-on. If you want to help, and we can use all the help we can get, head over to the gate and lend a hand to the guards. Not long ago, my... If you... I can only hope that Farwell and his knights manage to close that Oblivion Gate. The fate of Chaden Hall. Good day. Right. Good morning.
So if you don't know, if you've ever played the Legend uh, Elder Scrolls Legends card game, Jaden Hall actually had a part to play in the Great War. And um, um, and it was like, what are all your cards doing out here? I'd advise you to keep your distance from that accursed portal. Haven't you heard about these gates to oblivion opening up all over Tamriel? Yes, I have. Well, then you know what they're capable of producing. Although nothing has come through ever since Farwell entered. About two days ago, Count Indaris' son, Farwell, entered the oblivion gate with six other men. We haven't heard from them since then. The Count fears the worst. And has posted guards here so we can watch and see if anyone comes back out. And so far, nothing. At this point, Count Indaris is offering a reward for the recovery of his son from inside the gate. Or confirmed news of his demise. If you find him, or the rest of the Knights of the Thorn, get them out of there. I'm sure the Count would also be pleased if the gate was closed. New to these parts, eh? The Knights of the Thorn are a bunch of rabble who fancy themselves true knights. Farwheel formed the group around two years ago. They make grand boasts and talk a good talk, but that's all they are. The real work goes to us, the city guard. I hate to speak ill of them, as something horrible may have happened. But their own bravado got them into this mess. It's tolerated because Farwheel is the Count's son, plain and simple. He has the power and the coin to put it all together. Most of the time, they lounge around the tavern drinking and making up stories of epic battles with impossible odds that they won. It's all garbage. They never patrol. They never help fight off the occasional bandit that slips into the city. Ah, oh, well, I've said too much already. Farwell is a dunmer, and he's wearing steel-plate armor. His shield should bear the crest of the knights. <laughs> Nothing but the best for the Count's son. There are seven of them, including Farwell. Even though they're a nuisance, I still hope they haven't been hurt. Or worse. There are seven of them. There's only one way to remove that gate. Venture inside. Find the gate sigil stone and take it. Once you have it, the gate should be closed. From what I hear, you'll appear back where you entered, safe and sound. We will remain out here until the gate is either closed or something emerges from inside. We need to warn Chadenhall of impending attacks. Cool. So yeah, so Zayden Hall, uh, it was instrumental in taking back the, um, taking back the, uh, Imperial City during the Great War. Yep. Um, basically, uh, I can't remember his name. I can't remember his name, but basically, uh, there there was a Stalmore agent, right? The Stalmore that had Goldbrand, and somehow, some way, the um, the uh, Emperor Titus Me the Second um, had it, uh, got, or got 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 his hands on it somehow, um, and um, eventually. Uh, what ended up happening was, um, is that the, uh, okay, um, is that, is that the, um, hold on.
None of them. Shit. I'm stuck. Fuck all. Um, and uh, the, imp er, the emperor was almost assassinated, basically, and he was injured. Um, so the hero of that place, or, or s the hero of the story, um, um, ended up basically, for lack of a better word, um, um, lack of a better word um took up the emperor's armor and everything like that and um you know rode out as the emperor it's about time someone got here what took you so long we are knights sworn to uphold the laws of chaden hall we fear no being and we strike fast and true as lightning Many wish to join our ranks, as we are of the highest echelon. Only a select few may join the finest force ever to grace the lands of Cyrodiil. Until now, we numbered only seven, but attack like a regiment. Our enemies quake at our approach and falter at our charge. Huzzah! I set out with the rest of the knights to dispatch this blemish on the face of our fine world. When we arrived, we were overwhelmed. I myself was able to kill perhaps two score of them, but they just kept coming. Only Bremen and I remain alive. However, with you here now, we can take the sigil stone from that citadel and complete our quest for the good of all Chadenhall. Huzzah! Are you mad? Un now, I suggest... We are knights sworn to... Un all right. What is behind me right now? What is behind me right now? I, I'm very curious. Yeah, so basically, and then uh, they took back the Imperial City from Jadenal. Oh, hell no, hell no, hell no, hell no, hell no, hell no. I want him alive, fool. I want him alive. Well, luckily it auto saved. I dead? Fuck you. Wait, you are now and bleed to death! 
Let me get out of my way. All my fu- Okay, you know what? Uh, they're getting in the way. So frustrating. You know what? I'm going out. You want to attack these guys? Attack them. Let's try that again because I think they're going after them. Why are they going after them? Go after me. I'm getting stunned. Out of my You guys suck. You guys absolutely suck. Knights of Thorn my ass. Waiting for the thing to survive. You both are gonna die. You do realize that, right? Wait a minute. So where am I going? I'm on your side. 
I do realize that. Have you ever fought a danger before? Scared the crap out of me. Jesus Christ. You brought friends. to save it right here so I don't have to do that all over again. No, oh, you're gonna die. I knew it. I knew he was going to die. did this last time. Come on. Thank goodness. Because I want Far Well to live. I don't want him to die. Alright, let's get you out of here, Far Well. Oh.
Man, that was stressful the uh, the the uh, second go around. We made it. Uh, I mean, victory is ours once again. Huzzah! Huzzah! You've done well. I wouldn't have expected such bravery from someone who isn't a Knight of the Thorn. Now that this battle between good and evil has been won, and the day is ours, you should go speak with my father. He will reward you greatly for escorting me home and closing the Oblivion Gate. Since you have led us to victory, I am hereby giving you the honorary title of a Knight of the Thorn. Your name shall be revered, and your deeds placed into song to what be performed my by the greatest base red. generations to come. That's strange. Oh, it must be the screen as a knight of the thorn you are now expected to carry this symbol of your knighthood carry it proudly and wear it well cool no more will the gate threaten the good people of chadenhall the knights of the thorn have triumphed once more make sure you address the count I'm pleased to finally meet the savior of Chadenhall. I'm also overjoyed that you saved my son's life. I realize he's trying at times, and he speaks before he thinks. But he's still my son, and I adore him greatly. I'm sure he was difficult to travel with, and I respect your patience. Most would have given him up for dead, rather than deal with his ego. Anyway, I digress. I'm sure you wish to hear of your reward. I'm in possession of two fine weapons. They're both heirlooms of the Indaris family, held in the castle for several generations. I'd take great pleasure in bestowing one of them upon you. Please, choose the Thornblade or the Staff of Indaris. The Thornblade it is. Again, I thank you on behalf of all the citizens of Chadenhall, and I especially thank you as an elated father. Farewell, and may R.K. guide you. I will not forget your service to me and to Chadenhall. Rescuing my son from the Oblivion Gate was a daring feat. With the Oblivion Gate closed, I can now gladly send aid to Bruma. Even though he may be a bit misguided, I'm still proud to call him my son. Aww. I think if you had the chance to speak to any of the knights, they were happy to follow Farwill into battle. I'll be having a very long talk with my impetuous son. I don't blame him directly for their deaths, but he must learn to do things the proper way. He must realize he'll be ruling Chadenhall one day. That's a responsibility I aim to make him ready for. Goodbye. I'm over encumbered. <laughs> uh, what are my stats? Um, well, what's over encumbering me so much? What is? Hold on. Well, I don't need this. The thorn blade. What is this? Charge 9,000. But it's not better. Uh, it kind of is. Huh. Okay. 
Um, give me a second. I need to sell off some stuff, I guess. Because otherwise I can't bloody well move. This will only take a second and then I'll go to the Imperial City. Actually, no, you know what? Let's see here. Is it? Well met. Armor, weapons, I have it all. How may I help you? That's weighing me down a lot. Come back and see me again. Good day. All right. on the first two floors. Remember, trespassing in the Imperial Palace is a serious crime. Do not venture beyond the first and second floor. Alrighty. Uh, I guess I don't need the Imperial Palace then. I will do Miss Cargan because this is uh, very much uh, gonna be a doozy. Mm. All right, guys. Well, I will end the episode there. I just hit my mic. That's fantastic. All right, guys. Well, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. I got a brand new sword and uh yeah so what i will do is this oh. what i will do is um go to bruma um i'll record the episode immediately after this so that you guys can enjoy the rest of the finale um but anyways how are you today i'm doing good go away go away um but yeah so um yeah so anyways if you enjoyed this episode guys make sure to leave a like comment subscribe and all that fun stuff and i will catch you all in the next one next episode we will be finishing off the main quest and then eventually what what i'm thinking is is i'll finish the main quest take a break from oblivion um 
and then and then maybe possibly go on to Morrowind, a little bit of Fallout. Uh, so a lot of things to look forward to, guys. All right, so let me actually save it here so I, I don't have to worry about it. Um, thank you all for joining me and spending time with me. Um, I will be uploading more on the regular. Uh, I'm just trying to get my bearings and stuff. It's just taking me a while. Uh, so just be patient with me and I will catch y'all in the next one. Have a fantastic day. Goodbye.